my understanding is that he's a rhesus macaque. He's about he's a male monkey, about seven months old, so he's still a juvenile. He's quite young, and um, you know he seems to be doing fine. He's very tiny. Uh, he's had a little bit of a bad. Uh, Day, yesterday and today. He's okay. He's eating. Uh, he seems comfortable, but you know, obviously, he's going to be stressed because he's been separated from his family and he is a baby. So, um, you know, that's something that we're aware of. Um, and we don't have facilities, proper facilities for mon a monkey here. So, right now, he is having to be in a cage. Um, that the, the staff are also not trained on handling monkeys, so um, we're not handling him right now. And which is why we're working really hard to get him out to a sanctuary as quickly as possible. So they can carry herpes B virus, which isn't a concern for the monkey, but if it's, it can be transmitted to people through a bite or a scratch, and it can be quite serious for people to, to get this virus. So we're not sure if this particular, if Darwin is his name, we're not sure if Darwin is carrying that virus or not. So the owner's been fined under under, our, uh, under municipal code 349, and uh, there is a prohibited animal section under that bylaw. So um, that's that. His, so the owner was fined $240 for keeping a prohibited animal in the city. Certainly, with this monkey, it, it, there, there, there's a danger to the public for him to be loose in a parking lot, and also the animal's uh, safety is at risk. So. Um, you know, you need to stick to animals that are, are domesticated animals, they're, they're bred to be a pet, they're not bred to be wild animals, um, and so that, that's much more appropriate, definitely. Um, the exotic animals have extremely specialized care. Most people don't, uh, aren't able to provide the kind of care that they need, so uh, the humane thing to do if you're thinking about wading into that would not, just don't do it. I think that it, he's gotten so much attention because, you know, he, he did look really cute in his pictures yesterday and toddling around in the parking lot. You know, really the message is it's not, it's sad for him. This is tragic what's happened to him. Um, you know, he's now been separated from his family. He has to go live in a sanctuary. Really my, the strong message we want to send is uh, don't try to keep this type of an animal, especially in, this, in an urban environment.